not sure what else to expect as we go further along. I got a feeling I'm gonna, I'm gonna face more, um, face two or three vagaries later on. I get my rocket launcher out for the time being. Gee, I, what, has, what have they done to this place? What now? What have we got now? Let's see what's coming up. <gasps> oh my god! The Hell Knight! Again? He looks like same. He's been like the ones we've encountered in the Delta. in the main portal of the Delta Labs. Waves? Get away from me! Ow! And then an imp again. Did you know it? Oh. Where do these waves ever give up? Hmm. Oh, can't go through here. Oh no, there's that untangled growth again. What? How did I not hurt you? That one didn't flinch him? Okay, this is taunting, because there's barrels here. I better shoot... Best if I shoot the barrels, just to be sure. These barrels are explodable. Let's see what's going through this. There's a train there. Oof! The imp here? Well, it was a hell of a because if it was, he would have eliminated me. So we've got the soul cube charged up. Let me guess. Hell Knight! Oh, I saved the right timing. Oh, time that one, right? Oh, got more BFG 9000 ammo. Hmm. Oh, it's a, oh, it's a guy named Pierce Rogers. Oh, yes. <sighs> oh, no. We got Petruga's lap again. Oh, I don't like this. What now? Candles? <gasps> Archfile! Get away from me! Like I said, we need to take care of the art first before we keep some respect to the monsters I previously killed. There's the lab. Let's see what's beyond. <gasps> Let me guess. Revenant! I don't like these. Skeletons? No. Waves aren't skeletons. Well, oh, comp compressed air tanks. You know what they say? If you screw around, these tanks are gonna blow up. The Josh reference. Now what? Another way? Let me guess. If I kill every five demons, I mean the soul cube is fully charged. Oh no. Imps! Ow! Stop it! Oh. Ah, oh, so this is what. Whoa! Break up the soul cube. Another imp! Another imp! And then teleport it while I've killed the other one. <sighs> okay, let's just move on. I'm not sure if we encounter something nasty. It's gonna come out of here, isn't it? Yep! Ow! Yeah, the revenant's gone! No, it's not! <laughs> yes, it is! People are something who's behind me, isn't it? Ow! And the imp still 
Professor Lutia pouncing me. I think we need to find that Pierce Rogers person. Whoa! Where'd you come from? Oh no, we need to get security clearance for this. Hmm. Oof, pardon me, just hiccuped. Ow! <gasps> I hiccuped again! What's going on? Where's that coming from? <gasps> Hell night! End waves. Go on, Hell night. End a couple of waves. Hang on, these guys look like bands of hell. Uh, blah 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 blah. Yeah yeah yeah. Pierce Rogers! You have the soul cure. Yeah, I got it. Just like in the carvings I've been researching. If I'm correct, that cube is our only chance to stop this. No time to explain now. You need to get to the caverns quickly. The caverns? Where? Take my PDA. Where? It's right there on the desk. Oh, yeah. It's got security codes for the area and my research logs on it. It'll help. I can't go with you. I need to finish my work here. I'll, t I'll quickly take this. Good luck on your work, Mr. Rogers. And I promise I will stop this invasion. Oh my god, more waves? Why we've got rid of them? And we need to save Pierce Rogers. I know we've lost some few survivors so far. Oh no, more waves. I say this one just for you, Impelope. We've already saved Pierce Rogers. I know we've lost a few people so far. The first person we lost was that it was Mr. Edwards who was guiding us with the Alpha Labs, and that so when suddenly that imp appeared around the corner unexpected. And the second was the Sentry Bot who got killed by the Cacodemon. And the third was a, a guy who was in that service had to make Delta! There's a rare dent. Here you go! As I was saying, that guy in the service had ended up getting killed by that red imp in the Delta Labs. And then the third was that poor guy who was trying to run away from that security zombie. So suddenly the imp killed him in the end. Oh no, let me guess. Imps. I thought it was just them. Ow! Revenant! See, if I run around the corner... Wow! I never had a chance to dodge his missiles. Let me guess. Imp. What? Did you flinch him? An exploding battle didn't flinch him? Something teleported behind me, didn't it? Imp. Okay, let's go and train before something terrible happens. Finally. I've never been on the train before. I've been on a few trains so far in my home country. So I don't like... The only trains I'm into at the moment is the steam engines. Like, so far... I remember, I remember one time I went on, went on the trip on flight, and there was an imp. As I was saying, I was, I went, to, had a trip to Scarborough on one time on my famous steam engine imp. Imp. As I was saying, 
the, 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 the famous image in the world, the Flying Scotsman, which is in a class engine. Oh, you need to take care of that. Oh, you fired your what? You fired your last fireball. So here we are, the caverns. Before we go any further, let's, let's see if we can have a look at that. Uh, Piers Rogers dead. Well, I'm not going to wait this time to look at his emails. This is the audio log of Dr. Piers Rogers. I don't know if I'll make it off the base alive. I don't have much time, so I'll sum up what I have quickly and upload the rest of my finding into the data bank. I hope someone finds them. It was all on the stone tablets, all the answers. I can't believe we never saw it. It was as plain as day. If we had only slowed down the development of the teleporters and tried to really learn what the tablets were trying to tell us, trying to warn us. The ancient people battled the same demons that are attacking us now. The demons came through the teleporters that they built, just like now. They created the soul cube and used it to stop the demons, to drive them back to hell. I don't know how, but that must be the answer. That is why that artifact was left behind, left for someone to find if something like that ever happens again. I can't reach Delta from here. I won't make it. I truly hope and pray someone finds the soul cube. And it helps. Lord, help us. End of log. Hmm. So, I think the soul cube is the answer. So we need to go deeper into the caverns in order to stop this invasion before the fleet arrives. Ancient civilization. Hmm. This is Dr. Pierce Rogers, lead archaeologist currently stationed on Mars. As the preliminary reports have suggested, we have made some amazing discoveries here on Mars. Life on Mars has long been theorized, but we never imagined anything like this. The initial chamber was discovered in 2115. It leads into what is now known as Site 1. Site 1 is the largest of the sites, and we are still actively working there. It is made up of a series of chambers and connecting tunnels, all of which are covered in glyphs and symbols. Using the UAC pattern processor, we have finally been able to understand some of the glyphs, and from them, here is what we have learned. The ancient people looked like us, at least to the extent that they were bipedal and were similar in shape and size. Their level of technology was astounding. For instance, the glyphs at each site were carved into the rock by some sort of machine, and each one is precisely cut from the stone. It far exceeds the precision of anything we can do. They had a social structure that seemed very aristocratic, with a lot of emphasis on social stature and structure. Site 2 is a much smaller set of chambers, mostly containing burial sites, temples, and various amounts of individual artifacts. This site has been photographed and cleared out, and all material is back on Earth for study and review. Site 3 produced our prize artifact, what we call the Soul Cube. If you have read or seen the other material, you probably know that this once grand civilization was attacked by some unknown force. And if we can believe what is written in stone, they sacrificed most of their society to drive the invaders back. There are additional reports filed on the Soul Cube with Central Administration. We also recovered several other device-type artifacts. They are not as ornate as the Soul Cube, but each appears unique. We are still learning how to interpret all of the glyphs, and hopefully, once we have that completed, the science teams can provide more detailed information on their technology. Now, these are truly unique and special times for archaeologists. Phew, that was another helpful hint. But like my other video that Ian McCormick made about, about, about what is happening on Mars before hell erupted. Now we're going to head deep, now we're going to head deep into the caverns.